ASMR Gaming Mario Kart 8 Deluxe video. So today I'm going to be playing some single player. I'm going to be going into the time trials. And we're going to be playing uh, one of my favorite levels in uh, Mario Kart. Ever since they reintroduced it. Okay, looks like I unlocked something new. I don't really care for it though. We're going back to the standard. And want to know what my favorite course is. My favorite track is the SNES Rainbow Road. Uh, ever since they brought this version into like a Mario Kart. I think it was on the 3DS. And then it was ported over to the Wii U version. And now it's on the Switch version. I absolutely love this. Love this one. So, uh... Let's see more. Let's race against a ghost. Sometimes it takes a while to load. Hopefully this was a good decision to make. If not, I'll go back. I don't think it lets me cancel connecting. Because it's sometimes... It's... The servers for Mario Kart are sometimes really weird. When you try to upload, like, um... Race stats and stuff like that. Uh, yeah, an error occurred. I'm not even going to bother again. We don't have to race against the ghost. Let's just do it ourselves. Uh, ideally, if you're going for um, records, like for races and time trials where you're racing alone, you want to race with one of the bigger guys like Bowser. Because... If you're raising, if you're racing as a baby daisy, you're not going to be able to go as fast as you can with some of the larger characters, but it'll still be fun. So I love this level because everyone else is usually really bad at it and you just drift your way through the entire stage here and you have to like use your boost in uh, special situations like right here. Wait, no, like I did it wrong. See, I'm not even doing it correctly. After this, I'll try racing with uh, Bowser or something. No, I did not hit it correctly. But when you're playing against other people, this level is insane. Like, it's one of the craziest maps or stages to race on. There, I did the boost. And you want to get like max coins because every time you pick up a coin it raises your uh, max speed until you reach 10 and if you have 10 coins it raises your speed by 10 percent so it's always best to have max uh, coins when you're racing and i'm stay i'm saving my mushrooms i'm going to use one up ahead during the straight part up here We're gonna use one last one over here after this boost. Here we go. Let's see. I didn't do that great. I think I already had a better record than this one. Oh wait, no. Okay, it's a new record. Well, that's nice. Um, do it now. I don't want to upload it. It's fine. But I'm gonna change character. Let's do the same thing, but with like Bowser. Uh, we're gonna go a lot faster, so it's gonna be much harder, but Let's see uh, Where's Bowser here on the list or you know what metal Mario? I think he's of the weight class that we want You basically want something with best speed stats So this one this one But you're also gonna want a good grip like this one. Okay. No, no, 
no. I want that one. I want to do SNES Rainbow Road. Okay, solo race. Let's do it. Okay, so we're probably going to be going a lot faster this one compared to when we were racing with Baby Daisy. But it's also going to be a lot harder to control. So let's see how this goes. Because, let me tell you, drifting with the bigger characters, you have to be, like, extremely precise. So right now I'm going to try to pick up some coins. We took that jump a little bit badly. And I didn't get the turbo boost there. I have to relearn those. Nah, couldn't catch the waves there at the end. It's fine though. You can hear like the small vibration sounds in the controller. Oh, why am I not hitting these? That like little ping sound is actually vibration in the pro controller. Okay, there, I finally got the boost from that one at least. from that one. Okay, was that our best lap? I'm not sure. Oh, we're going a little bit too fast, maybe. No, we'll be fine. But if you're really going for like a world record, you have to stay right at the edge here. Like basically drive halfway off the stage, like the, the track, like it's crazy. Uh, well, I think this is a record, but I can do much, much better. No joke, on the 3DS version, I got down to like 1 minute and 17 seconds, I think, or something like that. Maybe 1 minute and 27 seconds, 1 minute and 17, somewhere around there, but... I was actually in like the top 100 uh, world record for the leaderboard for a certain period of time, like when Mario Kart 7 first came out, just because I kept replaying the stage over and over again. Let's retry it. I think you need to have a better cart, better wheels, but I absolutely love this stage. Rainbow Road, so much fun. Really difficult when you're racing against other people. Everyone's getting knocked off the stage, but I love it. We didn't take the boost there. Let's restart. I'm going to try to go for a better run than last time. So we're really going to have to hit those boosts. No. Did not start with the boost correctly. You need to, you need to press down the acceleration button right as soon as you see the number two, like... Oh, I might have done it a little bit too soon. Yeah, we messed up that time. When you see it and it's about to disappear. Like, uh... Three. Right there. Okay, we did it perfectly this time. Full boost. Oh, we didn't get it. But that's fine. We'll grab some coins here. I'm not gonna... No! start. We're going to need to do this correctly. We want to break the record, or my personal record, on this version. Nope. We didn't even manage to get that one. Okay, we did this ramp correctly. Oh, but we did not get any boost from that. I almost fell off there. But that's actually how you have to race on this course. Like, it's crazy. Nope. Yeah, that was a really good lap. Nope. See, I'm trying to jump there and catch, like, the wave boost. When they bounce you down, but I'm not doing it. Like, there, I got it. And you can actually do it twice if you immediately hit it after. We'll probably
probably be able to hit this one. And it's gonna launch us, yeah. Oh no, we're hitting this one. This might be our best lap, I feel it now. As long as we don't fall. I should have caught that boost back there. When the thwomp hit the track. Oh, I didn't, I didn't get this one either. Ah, uh, this might not be our best lap. No, we did even worse the last time. Uh, well, you just have to keep practicing and practicing the course until you get better. But yeah, I absolutely love this stage. So hopefully you guys found this relaxing or enjoyable. Uh, I, I sure had a lot of fun recording this. So thanks for listening or watching to this ASMR Gaming Mario Kart video. If you ever want to race on SNES Rainbow Road with me, just let me know. I'm more than happy to play with uh, subscribers on this stage. And it's one of my favorite courses, to be honest. Like, definitely top five for me. So, yeah, thanks again for watching. Please be sure to like, comment, share, and subscribe. And I will see you all next time.